This video is for people who use Git with their projects. If you don't use Git, please go to the PSK project import video in studio. The link is in the description. Hello everyone, in this video we will see how to import a PSK project to studio when it is version under Git. First, note that studio considers that your project is version under Git if a Git file is at the root of your folder. If it is the case, it is very important that Pokemon SDK is a submodule of your project. Let's start by opening the project in the terminal. To do this, just write cmd in the address bar, then press enter when you are in the project folder, of course. We will then list the submodules by writing git submodule status. You should see Pokemon SDK display with hexadecimal characters in front. If you don't see Pokemon SDK in the list, then the submodule is not initialized. If not, go directly to the next part. To initialize Pokemon SDK correctly, we will first delete the Pokemon SDK folder in the root of your folder. Once the operation is finished, you will version the change by writing git add -a followed by git commit -m remove PSDK as a folder. It's anyway wipes the command git submodule. Add git at gitlab.com colon Pokemon SDK slash Pokemon SDK dot git. This will recreate the Pokemon SDK folder as a submodule. This will allow you to update very easily. Since Pokemon SDK is a submodule of your project, it is possible to fetch the latest updates using simple command lines. Assuming you're using the official model, hit CD Pokemon SDK followed by hit checkout development, then git pull. If done correctly, this should download the latest changes and apply them. This makes your project partially compatible with Studio. Now you have to import it into Studio. For that, I invite you to watch the video that explains how to import a PSDK project to Studio. The link is in the description. Good luck!